Lucky enough to snag a Chromecast before they sold out online? Here's some cool tricks you can do with it. We've talked about the Chromecast a couple of times on here, and by now I'm assuming a couple of you out there already have one, and maybe, just maybe, you're watching this episode via Chromecast. And even if you aren't, there are a couple of rad workarounds this little dongle can do that aren't exactly advertised by Google. Sure, Chromecast lets you do tab casting, but did you know you could screencast your entire desktop? What you do is click on the cast button in Chrome and then access the drop down menu. There you'll see cast the entire screen option. Once enabled, your entire desktop will be streamed to your television, meaning locally stored videos and audio can be played back. It should be said there is a bit of lag with this experiment as to be expected since tab casting itself is in beta and the entire screen cast is experimental. Also, because only tab casting supports audio through the television, any media played while screen casting will have the audio coming out of your computer speakers. But if you want to watch local media like movies or TV shows you've downloaded, Chromecast can play those files with the sound on your television. All you have to do is just open up a locally stored file within the browser or drop it into Chrome. Once that's done, click the icon and it should start playing on your television. Again, there might be lag issues and the quality will probably take a hit. Also, this feature will only work on the desktop browser and not on mobile devices, for now. Or if you're not content with Chromecast, current settings, you can explore an extra set by going to the Chrome extensions window, click options, then right click inspect element. There you'll see a section that says display none, remove that and you'll get all sorts of settings like min and max bit rates, video buffer settings, network settings, and other developer settings. Just be careful futzing around with these since they could give you some unintended results. But what do you guys think? Is Chromecast the future of television or another product that's a stepping stone for something larger? Let me know in the comments below. And as always, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. For TFN, I'm Scott Bromley saying you can close the tab now. I'm done talking. Just kidding, I'm not done talking. Now I'm done talking.